Good morning, it's Lissy. It is Monday, March 21st, 7.48 a.m. So, we got snow last night, and it's still snowing. Um, the sidewalks have a little snow, the roads not so much, but my footwear choice is going to have to be... I'm going to throw on either some rain boots or some Uggs, <laughs> which both of which I hate to wear, but it's just for the walk to work. Um, and as I mentioned, I likely, I didn't even know if I'd do a video today because I was like, I didn't know how inspired I'd be given the weather, but because I'm wearing this little new thing, I wanted to show you. So this is a Tory Burch blouse I've had for a while, but this is this cute little, it's from Koss. I don't know if this tells us anything, but like, here's the info. Um, but I'll put a link to it, but I think they call it a jacket, but it's a knit and it's short sleeve. So it's going to be cute for summer, but I like to layer it with a, you know, I like a short sleeve with a long sleeve fun blouse and it has like a little bit of a shawl collar and a little bit of kind of an invert. Good morning. It's Lissy. It's Tuesday, March, I almost said May, March 22nd, 7.42. I'm kind of depressed today. Then, you know, I don't, part of me is like, should I even be doing this? It feels so, in the words of my father, banal and vapid to be talking about what I'm wearing when there's just been like an attack in Brussels and there are all these people hurt and scared and I don't know. But anyway, I'm just going to move along with the get up because that's what I do, I guess. <laughs> um, anyway, so... It's cold again today, 33 or something, but it's going to be into the 40s later and it's getting warmer later this week. We got the snow yesterday, but it all melted quickly. So I'm getting in the last of the like turtlenecks and stuff, but I'm doing a big chunky turtleneck and I'm wearing a leather jacket instead of like a heavy, I actually am going to take my puffer to be cleaned today. Am I being too optimistic? Optimism, pessimism. Optimism with the coat, pessimism with the whackness that's happening in the world. But anyway, I, digra I digress. So this is an old sweater from that I bought at Neiman's years ago from this line called In Habit Cashmere. I'm wearing Acris Punto trousers. You're sick to death of seeing the Chanel necklace and the Hermes bracelet that I wear every day. Oh, this this is the new Bite Cosmetics um, lip pencil thing that I got. And I did all the, um, you know, the same kind of face makeup, my new Laura Mercier, with all the, like, with the, wa you know, the water essence and the, you know, the primer and the, um, whatever they call it, you know, before moisturizer, after moisturizer, then the foundation. Um, I did my makeup differently today. I used a different, I have a bunch of Tom Ford quads, and this is, like, a little more purpley cooler tones than I usually wear, but I thought for this it would be nice. So why don't I step back? Oh, and I'm wearing um, these Christian Louboutin flats. Oh, I should tell you, which I think I meant to tell you this weekend and I forgot. So those Dior shoes, which actually I really like with these. I have a pair of tan Chanel flats with a black cap toe that I was going to wear today, but the tan is not the right tan for these pants. So that's why I'm wearing these Christian Louboutin flats today. But I might have worn my Dior shoes other than they're at the cobbler for two reasons. Well, one, I'm going to get the bottom protected. But two, I don't think I told you, I fell flat on my face one night last week. I left work. I was on my way to the gym. I was being stupid. I was too busy paying attention to my phone and looking where I was going. And I literally missed a step and, like, fell on my knees and on my hands. I still have – I'm actually fine. It was just one of those things you're shocked when it first happens. Um – but I do have bruises on my knees. So anyway, so I was wearing the new Dior shoes and you know, the front is a very pointy white patent toe. And of course I like nicked them. I'm like, you know, I just bought these stupid things. So they're at the cobbler in repair at the moment. But, um, so I think I'm gonna wear this. Let's try it on, I haven't tried it yet. This is a Alexander Wang, I think, black leather jacket. And then my new, Givenchy bag. Yep, so this is the get up for today, I think. 
And that's it. So have a good day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Good morning. It's Wednesday, March 23rd. Oh God, 7.52. The time change, I know we're like over a weekend, but I just can't get like into it. My alarm goes off. I cannot get up. My alarm goes off always at 6.09. Usually I would have already been up by then. Now it's like I'm dragging myself out of bed after 7. So here I am at almost 8 when normally I like to be to work by now. But anyway, so a couple things. One, I'm going in to get the hair touched up today because it's only two and a half weeks. And like, look at this, like not happy with this, this, like too much dark. Like if I had to wait till my normal five weeks, like this is what I should be like at five weeks. So after work, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> um, the other thing so I mentioned to you that I bought a bunch of stuff at J on jcrew.com and it all arrived yesterday and as painful as it was because I got so much crap. Well, I bought a bunch of stuff there and J Brand was having a um, friends and family. And so I bought a couple few pairs of jeans, like restocking ones that I really love that are kind of getting a little worn. Um, so I lugged all that stuff home. It was really heavy, <laughs> but anyway, I did. I tried everything on last night. And so I'm wearing today a pair of the J. Crew pants. So here's what I have to say about the J. Crew pants. I've gotten a, like, I think somebody commented that they heard, you know, from other, you know, read, saw other videos, other blogs that um, the J. Crew quality was not very good. I have to say, what I got, I thought it was perfectly fine. And the pants I got were like under $100. So I bought two different styles of pants, one of which I'm wearing today. Um, in two different sizes. So the ones I'm wearing today I bought in 10s and 12s, actually four different sizes, because I bought 10 regular, 10 tall, 12 regular, 12 tall, because I wasn't sure what the fit was going to be like. I ended up, because there's a lot of stretch in these, I ended up keeping the 10 tall, and the length is really just a preference. So I just want to show you. So these are, I think, called the teddy pant, and this is navy. Um, and I like it has a little kick flare. See, like, if the, the regular size was just, like, maybe a couple, of, you know, probably an inch or two shorter. And I just like it to hit closer to my ankle versus being more like a real capri. Um, but I really like them. So I bought these. And so I, I have a whole bag of stuff to go back. And then I also bought these more, like, gaucho-style pants. Um... And they didn't come in tall and regular. They were just whatever they were. And I bought them, I think I bought them in black and navy and 10 and in 12. And also I'm going to keep the 10. Because there's definitely a lot of stretch in them. I bought some pencil skirts in 12s because I know those tend to fit differently. And those, one, like I couldn't quite get, get it even zippered. And the other one, mm. like had enough stretch that I could get it zippered. But, um that, sorry, I just got a text and I saw it come through on my computer. <laughs> Distracted. <laughs> but, um, so I didn't keep either of the pencil skirts. Um, well, I'm not keeping either of the pencil skirts. But I'll show you some, like I bought a couple tops, like a couple cute basics, but you know, most of what I bought is going back, but that was by design. But I am happy, like with these pants, especially for $100, and especially like the style is you know, kind of an in style this year. I don't know, you know, how in it'll be like for the long term. So nice to not spend a ton of money on these. Um, so that's that. So I'm wearing the J. Crew pants. This is that Koss. Um, I really like this. It's just a lightweight, like I like the oversized sweater. Mixing up the jewelry because I can't keep wearing the same Chanel necklace that I wear every day. So I don't know if you guys remember, this is a Stephanie Cantus necklace. So you buy the chains and the pendants separately and the chain is long. So you can like either wear it long or wrap it twice. Like it's kind of, you can do a thousand different things with it and this pendant and then this, which I always wear. This faithful bag that I now have. And it's um, going to be warm and possibly rainy today, so I think I'm just going to wear the Burberry trench. So this is the whole... Oh, and my Dior shoes, which, oh, are now back. I should not have put them on yet. I'll show them to you another time. I don't want to have to lift my foot up this high. 
<laughs> but they're now back from the cobbler. Like they fixed the toe tips that were worn from my falling last week. And then also they put the, like I like to get that protector on the bottom of my shoes so they don't wear out. Um, and it gives you a little like traction that you wouldn't otherwise have. Um, so anyway, this, I will likely not do a video tomorrow. It's Thursday and then Friday's a holiday. Like I'm going to New York. So tomorrow I'm going to be lugging a bunch of like, um, my suitcase and all that to work. So I don't know. We'll see. This may be the end of it for a week, the week. If it is, I hope you've had a great one and I will see you soon. Bye.